after weeks or months with your continuous write-up finally you have completed your manuscript for submission in order to get a publication however your university requires you to submit to a scopus index journal so how do you find one hello everyone my name is dr teo i'm a family doctor and also medical lecturer from advanced medical and dental institute university science malaysia batam so today i'm going to share with you regarding the strategies to identify scopus index journal there are few methods to identify scopus index journal in this video i'm sharing two methods that i'm using go to scopus.com move to the lower segment of the page click on the scopus source list download the file it will come out an excel sheet the, this Excel sheet contains all the journals listed in Scopus. For further discussion in this video, I am going to use the Malaysian Journal of Medical Sciences, MJMS, from my university, University Science Malaysia. So, from the Excel sheet we download, go and find, browse through the list and find the journal name, MJMS. So, it means that it is a Scopus index journal. The next thing we want to know whether this indexing is current and active. So we look here is still active and ongoing. Note that we need it to be active and ongoing. Some journal they are being removed from Scopus list. So we need to be uh, very particular in this uh, status. However, the list I downloaded just now is updated to October 2019 so if you're gonna publish your manuscript way later than October 2019 you I will advise you to download again the list prior to submission just to make sure that the journal is listed in Scopus or you can use my second method for my second method go to scopus.com click on sources then you will move to this page. In the sources page, change the category to title of the journal. Then type in the journal's title and find the source. You will get this uh, search result and click into the journal name and you will get the journal details. So same with the first method we need to make sure that the status is active and current so for this mjms from the second method we can know that is uh, until 2019 i hope that this video is able to guide you to choose a scopus index journal and to avoid a predatory journal so stay tuned and see you again in my next video regarding isi index journal thank you